Yo guys, this is Laro. You already know that today I'm bringing you guys another installment of our showdown shenanigans. This is going to be another entrant in our uh, little pass it thing that we're doing. I'll get into more details about that later. But before we get into details, I have a friend with me. Do you want to say hi? I prefer acquaintance. Well, whatever the title he likes to be called, Mr. Chaos in the Sky is here. So we're going to battle you know him. I'll, I'll have you know I'm a doctor. D I it's do highly, it's, I, it's Doctor Chaos in the Sky. I, I have, doubt that. I have a legitimate fake doctor PhD, <laughs> what should we call it, from Walmart that I can, I can take a picture of and tweet right now. All right, well, you do that, and I will call you Doctor once, and then, nah. So yeah, that's gonna be, <laughs> <laughs> that's gonna be what we're doing. Once and then nah. <laughs> that's what we're gonna be doing, um, basically. Uh, the Pokemon All-Star Invitational Tournament number two that happened like two weeks ago that I couldn't participate in. Me and either. It Chaos upset me. Could, yeah, and Chaos could not participate in either. He was working. I was computerless. Hate my, list, so. hate my boss. My boss sucked. <laughs> yeah, so we're both going to uh, battle each other. We're going to give ourselves ten minutes to team build against each other. Uh, and then I'm going to go over you with you guys, my team, while Chaos is not here. And then he will rejoin us and we're going to battle because that's lots of fun. So... I changed my mind. I don't want to battle you anymore. Well, I'm battling you anyway, so... Wow! <laughs> <laughs> Alright, he just doesn't want to do that because he's scared. He knows that we're going to win, so... I'm afraid that I'm going to embarrass you in front of your whole channel. That's really mean of me to do, honestly. <sighs> Come on now. I highly doubt that I can be any more embarrassed than I already have been on my channel before. <laughs> <laughs> if, if anybody watching still has respect for me and my battling skills, I... Mm, they probably just joined yesterday. So, <laughs> either way. Not even bad. All right, we're gonna we're gonna wrap this little intro thing here. I will see you guys back uh, when I uh, go over my team. See you then. All right, guys. So I'm here bringing you the team breakdown for uh, my little battle here against Chaos. Um, his team. Uh, remember that this was a team that we drafted. Of course, my team: Regirock, Entei, Alexander, Trevenant, Exudo, Slowking. That's the team I drafted. Uh, the team. That Chaos drafted was oh crap! I didn't actually write this down. It was Victini, um, Sock, Electros, Shaman, Mega Blastoise, and Dragalge. So, yeah, that was a fun little team. Uh, I felt like I had a really good matchup against his team, so I'm really hoping that I can actually win this game. Um, I actually had a problem with team building a lot because I didn't feel like I had enough moves to fit like four slots like a lot of my Pokemon only need two moves to hit his whole team so uh, the only thing I need to worry about is having switch ins to things uh, I need to try and keep the offensive pressure as much as I can um, and not lose that momentum if I do then that's gonna be really bad for me so yeah let's go ahead and uh, jump into why I'm bringing what I'm bringing you guys get the gist by now if this is something new to you go back and watch the previous two showdown shenanigan videos and everything will be explained in more details but this is basically just like a league match and so I want to uh, dust the you know get the dust off so uh, that way when the Pokemon Premier League starts back up again I will uh, <clears throat> make smarter choices so alright the first Pokemon that I brought is Assault Vest Regirock which I don't know how it's gonna work but why not and this is kind of to do with Victini. Uh, physical Victini can't do anything to a Regirock, um, but if it's Surprise Special Victini, I want Regirock to be able to live a hit as well. Um, I don't know, I just feel like it can do a lot of work. It can also probably uh, just switch into other special attackers, potentially things like Electros, uh, Dragalge, maybe. Probably not Dragalge, let's be real. I probably wouldn't do that. I'm not that stupid am I um, although to be fair I don't really have a switch into Dragalge but either way this is max HP max attack adamant for special defense with Stone Edge Drain Punch Earthquake Encounter this one uh, basically all I needed was Stone Edge and I like I didn't feel like I needed much uh, I don't know if you heard that but uh, yeah that was my phone either way uh, so yes yeah, Stone Edge basically hits what I needed to hit which is Victini uh, drain punches to try and get health back because I'm a salt vest so I don't get leftovers recovery. Earthquake hits Dragalge and counter could be a really fun way to deal with Victini. Uh, should that be the case, I might lead off with it. Maybe I'll just lead off with counter Regirock because if he starts off with Victini, he'll probably just U turn. Uh, counter could be lots and lots of fun. So I might, I might do that. 
That'd be really cool. Uh, either way, the next thing I'm bringing is uh, Choice Banded Entei, and here you already start to see that uh, I run out of coverage moves. Uh, Entei, all I really need was Sacred Fire and Stone Edge. Uh, that's going to hit most of his team. Things like Mega Blastoise, Entei doesn't really get a coverage move to hit. Uh, same thing kind of applies to Dragalge, but if I can get a burn on that, that'd be great. Uh, residual damage uh, with something against something that doesn't really have reliable recovery. Uh, Toxic is the best thing I have to hit Blastoise. That's why I have it. Body Slam, just because I probably never want to use it. Sacred Fire Stone Edge is the main thing. This is max attack, max speed, jolly. Um, with four special defense, I want to have the most speed possible. That way, I have a better chance of outspeeding Shaman because uh, that requires Chaos to bring max speed, jolly, or timid Shaman to uh, speed tie with Entei. So Choice Band, uh, just to do some damage. I don't think Entei is going to be super important this match. Um, but it's there. <coughs> Mega Alakazam here is going to have Shadow Ball, Psy Shock, Energy Ball, and Thunder Wave. Uh, I originally had Substitute, but then I was like, nah. Um, max Special Attack, Max Speed. That really shouldn't be a timid nature. Um, I think it's just because I, I clicked this thing here. Um, in a perfect world, it would be modest because there's no reason I need a timid nature on the Mega Alakazam. Um, but it's too late. It's after the 10 minute timer, so it is what it is. Uh, Thunder Wave is just to slow down anything that's scarfed, if I could even, if I can even live a hit. Uh, Shadow Ball, you know, can hit things like Bikini. Psy Shock is a nice stab move, and Energy Ball specifically hits Blastoise. So, yeah, that's Mega Alakazam. That's a cool thing. I feel like, uh, this team, compared to my last two, is, uh, probably the best one I've built so far. I'm hoping, I don't know, maybe I didn't overlook, hopefully I didn't overlook anything, like, too bad. But... Uh, Trevenant here is Citrus Berry Harvest, uh, basically max HP, max special defense, careful nature, lead seed, poison jab, will o wisp Shadow Claw, poison jab, hit Shaman, will o wisp burns things that aren't named Vitini, lead seed helps get, uh, me recovery as well as if I have a lead seed and I can switch out something else and get a little bit of recovery potentially, and Shadow Claw is something to hit Vitini if it wants to switch in. So, that's fun. Uh, that's decently standard in terms of spread, nothing too crazy. And yeah, then we have a uh, Scarfed Moldbreaker Exadrill, he has an Electros, I have no reason not to bring Moldbreaker, S Choice Scarf is going to allow me to outspeed anything on his team outside of Scarfed Victini or Scarfed Shaman, so, um, but I had to put Max B Jolly to make sure that I outspeed a Scarfed Sock, um, even though I can't Oko a Sock, so that's the thing. And here's another thing, basically Earthquake kind of destroys almost his entire team. Um, it can one or two hit KO everything on his team. And X Scissor uh, just hit Shaman more, so that was the only other thing that I could think of. Literally no other coverage moves give me more damage than these two moves do. So that's why I threw Stealth Rocks and Toxic on here. I don't expect to use Toxic. I may use Stealth Rocks uh, because he does have a Victini. Um, but I really like the idea of leading off with Red Rock and going for counter if he like goes for U-turn or something. That'd be that sounds like a lot of fun, honestly. Uh, I might do that. We'll see. But Stealth Rocks are there as well. And then the last one is going to be Physically Defensive Slow King with Rocky Helmet, Regenerator, Scald, Psy Shock, Thunder Wave, uh, Dragon Tail. Uh, this is another mod with Thunder Wave. This one has a better chance of living a hit uh, and then slowing down something like a Victini or, I don't know, anything else. Uh, Scald is good. Nice stab. Hits Victini. Uh, Psy Shock hit Sock for a lot of damage. Uh, if it doesn't kill it, uh, I don't know, this thing can take one Sock pretty well. And Dragon Tail, I just, I was scrambling last second to try and put a fourth move and I saw that and I was like, sure, why not? I don't know if I'll use it. But, uh, this is my team. I don't know if it's legal, but, like, some of these things, like, I don't know if Dragon Tail, Dragon Tail's probably legal. I'm really not sure about Body Slam Ante. I feel like that's probably going to be one of those, like, like, <coughs> like, Gen 2 moves that it learns or something. I don't know. But that's my team. We'll see how it works out. Uh, we are going to get Chaos back up in this call and then we're going to battle. So, I will see you uh, right now in, in a second. Alright guys, so we are into the battle here against Chaos and Chaos is back with us. Go ahead and say hi again, I guess. Hey, how's it going? I don't want to do this anymore. I changed my mind. <laughs> yeah, probably for good reason. Uh, if you guys saw my team breakdown, you, you, see, you see the stuff that's going on. So, uh, yeah. Uh, I'm going to do what I said I was going to do, and I'm just going to do this, because 
Can I your team completion. stop being so threatening? Oh my goodness! Nah. This is the first time that I feel like I have a chance of winning. <laughs> it, like, compared to the last two I did. I am so rusty with this game. I'm gonna have to, like, jump back into the OU, like, the ladder of all ladders, yeah. and start playing this game a bunch this next month before PPL starts. Yes. Yeah, I don't think I mentioned, but uh, you guys should definitely uh, hey, that's a rich check rock. out Chaos because he's in Pokemon Premier League Division 2, which is much hype and things. Doing it. I clicked the thing that I said I was going to click. YOLO. Don't do it. Yeah. Oh. 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 Uh. That happened. How did you know I wouldn't be Special Energy Ball? I didn't. It was a really a risk. <laughs> um, also, Your Red Rock has 8 HP, by the way. What? Or 8%. Uh, well, it says 7% for me. It says 8% for me. That's weird, really? Yep. Yeah, I also- That was a horrible move, by the way, but I really just wanted to use Final Gambit. Yeah, that- That just took away Victini. I'm- I'm okay with that. Yep. I also <laughs> thought that would kill you, but I forgot that I didn't put HP investment in my Victini. Uh, yeah, that probably would have done it. Also, I probably could have lived in Energy Ball, just saying. Well, yeah, you would have <laughs> but your your counter would have been completely worthless because it doesn't work. That's true. That's true. It was a risk I was willing to take. Uh, I'm ashamed, by the way, in case you couldn't tell. What? I'm ashamed, by the way, in case you couldn't tell. Uh, I can see. Are you sure? Yeah, I'm just gonna, yeah. Hi. There's no point in keeping Retro Rock alive. It outspeeds nothing. Uh, okay, so you're special, Shaman. That's good to know. Now. Okay, so you're not choiced. That is also good to know. Why did I do that? You're natural. Why did you burn my natural cure mod? Is what I was just about I to say. Literally. Don't judge me. I just did. Okay. He stayed in. That's cool. Oh, spit up drop. Poison jab. Yeah, it's like a really high chance on Seed Flare. I'm pretty sure. It is. Mm. Say forty percent chance. Hmm. Can I? Hmm. All right. Ooh. Calking time. <laughs> Calking time. I've I've calked like nothing in. Uh... I'm basically my seed flare is basically plus two now. So if you're calking, if you live one, you live one, easily. Uh, really? Yeah, because you're at half your special defense, so it would do double the damage, 32%. Toxic does, like, 16% this coming turn. Mm, okay. Uh, that's also... So, yeah, if that's what you're looking for... Not what I was calking. I'll tell you. Oh, All wait right. a minute. Ooh, okay. I calc Mega Alkazam, not regular Alkazam. I'm taking a Seed Flare. They have the same special defense. Wow. <laughs> wow. Well, shows how much I know. All right. Uh, I don't know what I want to switch into this thing. Uh, I don't even know if I want to switch into this thing. Probably not. I pretty sure I really you need can. shame in those. I really need shame in those. Oh, I have colors. natural cure now. Ow. Yes. Yeah, you do. Ooh. Oh, if only I wasn't burned. I took that. You a did lot better that. than I thought Expected. I would. Probably because you're not offensive. Bum, 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 mm. bum. Mm -hmm. I gotta calc something now. I really shouldn't have final gambited with Victini at the very start, but you that really was what I was have. telling myself. As soon as I see the Red Rock, because I had nothing for it, so my thought process was as soon as I see the Red Rock, I use final gambit, and I clicked it without even thinking. Like I probably shouldn't be doing it turn one. What happened to Special Energy Ball? No, I was physical. Well, I mean, but you said you had nothing for it. I mean, you could have brought... It was much better to run physical Victini against your team. I mean, yeah. It literally kills everything except the Regirock, and <laughs> V-Create does 40 to 50% to the Entei. Ooh. Everything else gets O-Code by V-Create or Bolt Strike. Oh. In fact, V-Create v -create v -create does 40 to 50% to your Entei, it O-Codes your Mega Kazam, your Excadrill, and your Trevenant, and then Bolt Strike to hit KOs your uh, Slow King, even if it's defensive. I I have to do this. Mm. Help this. Oh wait a minute. Okay, no, that's right. That's right. 
As long as you're not something. As long as I'm not something. Mm hmm. I don't know if my cow gets brought up in the recording or not, so otherwise, I would circle it with my mouse. Ow. Alright, cool. You're oh, not... wow. I did not expect that to kill. You would have only lived if you were max HP, max special defense. No, that was my physically defensive mon. I did not think that would kill me, though, honestly. That's what I cow. Yeah! Mm, Mega Alexam putting it. Actually, no, Mega Alexam doesn't kill your whole team yet. Dang it. Hmm. There's one kind of big threat that I'm not really looking forward to. That I'm well, I mean, you've already about. won, so. I knew I mean, you won as soon as I final gambit it on the first turn. Uh, and I even kind of knew that when I was clicking it, but I was like, nah, I want to use final gambit bikini. Yeah, so that's really fun. Do I want to. I don't care, I'm still going to do this. Alright, cool. Okay. That's the thing that I don't. Hmm. Hmm. Dang it, I knew you were gonna do that. I mean, why wouldn't I? Oh, and I do. Yes! You would poison yes. me! Yes! That's fine. Is it fine? I mean, I'm natural cure, so yeah, it's kind of fine. You stay then, interesting. Stop! Uh... I definitely win the Stall War, by the way, in case you were wondering. I'm pretty sure the Stall War never ends, actually. If I harvest I, I'm berries. poisoned, I'm poisoned, you're toxic. Okay, well. <coughs> Try this one for size. Hey, that's an Entei. It is an Entei. What are you gonna do about it? Can you not have an Entei? Uh, that's kind of not how the rules work. I drafted it, so it's, I kind I'm of I'm going get to it. need you to change the rules. I can't do that. I do Bam! not go oh, for Don't you dare burn Yes! Yes! Calm down, Sly. <laughs> this is a dead gouge. I'm so happy. Calm down. Oh, now I have nothing to kill shoot. That's not. That's actually a lie, is it? That's not a lie. How do I kill Shaman? Life is a lie. Wait. Hmm. How do you? Wait a minute, Sly. How do you kill my Shaman? I need an Entei for that. Hmm. Sly, how do you kill my Shaman. I don't understand. What? How do you kill my shaman? I don't understand. By crossing my fingers and hoping... My your fins? You're gonna cross your fins. Fingers. Alright, hold on. Fingers. Are you... Mm, mm, I still don't know what set you are, but I feel like... I'm not a standard set, so good luck finding it. Oh, well... I'm just going to say, my guess is a physically defensive Shaman. That's that's my guess. Look at something. Okay, I wow, how did you- that's so bull! Wait a minute. Wait a minute. You either have a little bit of defense investment, or you have none, and I just got the lowest roll possible. I have max HP. Yeah, but with max HP... Well... I just, mm, are you adamant? No. And that's why. But the rule for max HP and no, phys, or no, yeah, no defense investment, it's forty-four point five minimum. Oh yeah, I just saw that. You did get a really low roll, but I missed a seed flare, so it's fine. True, but oh wait, are you max special attack? Ooh, hold up. Eh. I can't believe I freaking missed a seed flare. That's so stupid. Ow. And there we go. <laughs> All right. Don't mind me. We got this. Um. Okay. Why didn't I put toxic on this? This was supposed to have toxic. Sub toxic. What kind of sock is this? I didn't know how to use sock. It was supposed to be able to take on anything after I put up a sub, but I forgot toxic for slow king. It for some reason has earthquake for no apparent reason. I mean earthquake. Uh. Close combat would have done fine to the entire. I didn't need <laughs> you for that. Yeah. I was gonna say earthquake hits Excadrill and Regirock, but so does close combat. You like? I feel like I still have the upper hand, but I I don't know hey. how to like Ow. finish. Pause. <sighs> no, let's not. All right, let's. Let's, you know what, no, it, no, it, screw it. 
Not no, you stayed in. Why'd you stay in? I thought you were just gonna volt switch. <laughs> I, I thought that's what you thought, and you were gonna go into Excadrill so you could EQ me. Uh, nah. Not worth the risk. Hmm. Ooh. Mm. I should have run offensive shaman. I wanted a crit. Ow. Okay. You never understand that I'm natural cure, do you? No, I like I know. <laughs> but now. <laughs> oh, hey, we both switched. Oh no! Why did you switch? Because I didn't want to be paralyzed. Well, that's that's stupid. You're stupid. Oh, hey, that's hey, okay. you're dead. Ow. <coughs> nice. Ow, my soul. Okay. Just, I can't. I can't. You can't. Crit. Ow. Oh, my Why gosh. Would you oh, you're scarfed. Yeah. I can't take this thing out. I have nothing. You don't have Fire Blast on that Slow King? Or Ice Beam? No. That was a bit of a mistake on your part. You don't have any... You don't have, like, HP Fire on your Alakazam. No, even if I did, I highly doubt it would do that much. I mean, Alakazam has base 175, so, you know. Uh... Ow. Oh, that does... I mean... Oh, that didn't kill you. Okay. 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 Now we have a game. Wait a minute. Now we have a game. Ow. Oh, now we have a game. Oh, wait. But... Ow. I mean, at some point you have to attack. Yep, I just have to have a decent amount of HP before I do it. This is my last synthesis, by the way. Nice. I mean, Which is fine, because this is where I wanted to get to. I don't need synthesis anymore at this point in the game. Uh, hmm. Welp. Why do I always lose? <laughs> I would just like to remind everyone that I final gambited turn one with Victini. Why do I always lose? Ah. <sighs> I'm surprised your first thing to do wasn't set up rocks. Because I thought that you would go for rocks. Did you have Stealth Rock on Red Rock? No. I have it on my Scarfed Excadrill, though. Oh, okay. That would <laughs> be nuts. Yeah, I mean, I could have put rocks, but I just... Li oh, no, no, no. My Red Rock was Assault Vest, so I couldn't put rocks. Oh, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. That makes sense. That right. way I could live a surprise energy ball with a lot better than... With a lot better. I agree. <laughs> I... Uh... That's an extra drill. Crit. Don't you dare crit me. Okay, good. Dang it. Do 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 do. I'm so done. I don't want all these. I actually moves. really wish I had synthesis right now, but I'm pretty sure I win either way. Actually, I don't think you live the seed flare. Even, I'll nope. say, even if I did, Electros takes me out because everything else. Be I can't believe I won that. <laughs> I really thought <sighs> I was going to lose after the whole Victini thing. I did not expect Shaman to be as much as. As soon as you. As soon as, uh, what was it? We traded we traded Regirock and Victini, and then we traded Dragelge and Entei, and when you lost both of those, specifically Entei, there was not much you had for my Shaman. Entei, Entei was the answer to Shaman. It was choice banned and sacred fire. Shaman's not taking yeah, that that's well. Yeah, that was the one problem. That's why I didn't focus my team around Shaman, was because you had an Entei, and I did not have a rock setter. <laughs> Anyways, do you kind of want to go over, or at least have me go over my team a bit? Yeah, go for it. Alright, so I had... <laughs> this Victini could have just run the whole game <laughs> if I didn't final gambit. Because I had Choice Scarf and I was adamant. Because I knew you can't run E-Speed and Sacred Fire without adamant Entei. So we would have been speed tight either way. You couldn't have been jolly. So my Victini with Choice Scarf, I'm pretty sure... I think it even out. Wait. I'm pretty sure it outspeeds Scarf Excadrill. Wait, I can't be jolly with what? 
Intei, if you have Sacred Fire, isn't that how it works? Because it's an event? Or not, uh, I mean E-Speed. Oh, okay, I was gonna say, I didn't have E-Speed, because I was Jolly Entei, and I had Sacred Fire. Ah, okay, okay, but I thought you would have the E-Speed. So, I had Adamant, uh, Choice Scarf, Physical Victini, with V-Create, Bolt Strike, and U-Turn, then I had Final Gambit. Nice. For, uh, for whenever, when I decided I didn't need any more, and I had Regirock, which apparently decided I didn't need it at the start of the first turn. (laughs) Regirock was, Regirock was honestly the thing I was worried most about. Uh, my... Electros had Volt Switch, Acid Spray, Flamethrower, and Flash Cannon. Flamethrower let me hit Exca and Trevenant, and then Flash Cannon let me hit the, uh... The only thing I couldn't hit with it was Entei. Mm -hmm. Flash Cannon let me hit the, whatchamacallit, the Regirock. Yeah. Uh, my Sock was really weird, because I had no (laughs) idea what to do with Sock. Yeah. So I had Sturdy as my ability. Yeah. I had Life Orb. I had Substitute. (laughs) And then Fire Punch... Fire Punch, Close Combat, and I meant to have Toxic, but I forgot to switch Earthquake for Toxic. So I had Earthquake, because nice. Toxic was supposed to let me hit the Slow King, and Close Combat was enough to hit the Entei, with Stab and all that. Uh, and it was max speed, so. Then I had Shaman. Shaman was my specially defensive Mon, and it was pretty much my answer to Trevenant and Slow King, because it could easily go into both of them, mm-hmm. with Seed Flare, Synthesis, Earth Power, and Toxic. And then Natural Cure Leftovers, Max Special Defense, and then 252 HP. And it could also really take on uh, Alakazam pretty well, except for Sh- Psy Shock. Uh, then, then I had Mega Blast Toys with Scald, because is it three or four of your mons are weak to water? Uh, one, two, three. I think three. three of them. Three of them, and then Scald like two-hit KO'd Mega Alakazam, I'm pretty sure. I, I believe it. But, uh, yeah, so I had him with Scald, Rapid Spin, Ice Beam, and Toxic, because I was expecting you to try and take advantage of rocks, because my team isn't, like, weak, weak to rocks, but it can chip damage, and it hurts Victini, which was supposed to be my most important Pokemon. <laughs> and then, because of your weakness to water, with half of your mons being weak to it, I had a Choice Specs, Adaptability, Dragalge, uh, with Hydro, Hydro Pump, T-Bolt, for the, so I get it, the Slow King, and then Draco and Sludge Wave. Oh, so Hydro goodness. Pump... Draco Meteor destroyed, like, everything. Hydro Pump was pretty much just to hit Entei and Regirock, more specifically Regirock, because I figured Regirock would be your go-to switch in for it. Mm, I, I didn't really have a go-to Dra- switch Because Draco, Draco, like, destroyed everything on your team, even the uh, Slow King. Draco, I'm pretty sure, did half. I, I, yeah, I believe it. I was also physically defensive Slow King, so... Yeah, pretty much what my original plan was, was to lead with Victini and then U-turn, and just consistently U-turn and then semi like use slash fodder the rest of my team until i could kill uh regirock and then just have victini destroy everything but that did not even happen somewhat slightly no not not at all i saw the regirock and was just like i'm doing it (laughs) i really wanted like i knew it wouldn't have done a lot but i just wanted you to like hit u-turn and then i just counter on like just get some random chip damage on something else and like i don't know i actually want to see how much my victini set Let's see, if I'm 252 attack, adamant. And then your Regirock had no defense investment? No, but max HP. Well, max HP doesn't affect how much damage I do to you, that affects how much you take. Oh, okay. Uh, U turn would do to you 10 to 12%. Counter, how much does it do back? <laughs> I think double? it does double. <laughs> so it'd be I think like it's 20. double. So that'd be 20 to 25% back. Nice. I mean, that's chip damage. It is. <laughs> That's something, right? Yeah. I, I would have like, gone into my I would have gone into my shaman if I had U-turn that first turn though, so it would have been pretty useless. I also just kind of ran out of coverage moves because like I was just like, hey, Scarfed Excadrill Earthquake kinda wins. Alright. What else do I what else do I put on this team? Yeah, that's quite why I had X Scissor, but because uh Choice Scarf Sock is actually pretty common, so I had to run Max B Jolly on Excadrill, otherwise a scarf sock that would I was considering would. scarfed sock, but mm-hmm. then I figured you would be switching stuff away from it, expecting just that. Yeah. Like switching into something else to take it, like into Trevenant and stuff for which we call which is why it was supposed to have toxic, and it had fire punch for Trevenant, and yeah. it was supposed to have because I figured you'd be it would be like you saw my sock, knew it was choice scarf against like your Kazam with knockoff. I didn't even have knockoff or against your Red Rock or something. So close combat knockoff coming your way, you would switch into either the Slow King, which I would. I would set up a sub that turn, and then either Toxic the Slow King, or Fire Punch the Trevenant, or Toxic the Trevenant, depending yeah. on what I wanted. But I forgot to put Toxic on it, and that kind of messed me up. Yeah. Alright, well, that happened. So, that was that was the, the battle, and the team. I've been embarrassed 
three battles in a row. Have you lost all three of these battles you've done? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. What was that about first place in the PPL? Yeah. Hey, that's still <laughs> happening. This is this is before the season. This is me getting the dust off. This is me getting yeah, all the I bad plays the out of thing. the way. I gotta like I gotta and... like shake off a lot of rust. Like you yeah. saw me final gambit turn one. I've got a lot of rust to shake <laughs> off. Yeah, I think I think if I would have just like identified Entei as like a win condition, like that would have saved one a of lot the, of things. One of the biggest problems I have with battles is I always focus on just taking out what's in front of me instead yes. of focusing on what I have to have to win. Yes. Because you need to like in your in your case, you were just kind of focused on Dragalgy, it's a threat, get rid of it. Yeah. But like Trevenant. You didn't need Trevenant in this battle, in my no, opinion. Because Trevenant no. was pretty much just, every time I saw your Trevenant, you know what I thought as soon as I saw it. And literally <laughs> during the battle while we were battling and I saw that your Trevenant was still alive, yeah. I was just thinking, that's synthesis fodder for my for my Shaman. That's and fair. that's why that's what I want to use it for. That's fair. So like, yeah. it would have been a lot better to switch Trevenant into, plus I used Hydro Pump. It would have been a lot better to switch Trevenant into an expectant Draco or anything else and let it die Yeah. so that you could uh, keep Entei. Because you didn't really, with... Uh, cause Alakazam and Excadrill both did under half to Shaman, even though I wasn't physically defensive. Yeah. That's... And, uh, that was kinda, you didn't have anything that could really handle Shaman. Nope. At that point. Nothing that could handle it well. Like, you started to PP stall me a bit, cause like I said, that was my last synthesis on Alakazam. Yeah. But we were so late in the battle at that point it that didn't I didn't matter. need synthesis anymore. Uh, yeah. It happens. I'll get better. I'm gonna keep. I might have another one of these matches. I might not. I don't know. Either way, I'm still probably gonna practice draft formats in some way, shape, or form before the PBL starts. So, but we're gonna stop rambling. Um, uh, for the sake of video purposes, this is already longer than the other two have been easily. But it's because I'm better. It's because you talk a lot. Um, wow, <laughs> you were talking too. I. I mean, yeah. Hmm, whatever. All right, so we're just gonna end, <laughs> we're gonna end the video, guys. In the I'll video see you. slide, just in the video. I will see I'm you go guys cry. next time. Why are you crying? I'm the one that lost. And thanks for watching. Uh, till the next time, guys. Stay slide.